Hi, uh, this is a little video of our 1982 Corina Explorer that was built by the um, Gibson employee, therefore it has a stamped serial number inked actually, not stamped like, uh, like all the regular production and um, this is more, you know, meant to replicate the original 1958s. If we go over the specs of this guitar, um, particularly this guitar weights nine and a half pounds. Um, it is a Corina, so it's lighter than what a regular mahogany guitar would weight. The neck on this particular guitar is flatter than the regular production 82 reissues those um and, and it's actually wider too this is more like a 58 on on the other ones they they try to replicate a 60 which is not period correct this one is more accurate to what it was a 1958 with a little shaved back so it's a little flatter than a regular les paul 58 uh, it comes with uh big frets those white frets that were popular back in in, in 1958 and uh, Seymour Duncan pickups are original on this guitar. It was uh, built by an employee, so he decided to go with Duncan's. Uh, there is um, lots of checking. It's a 1982 guitar, and the lacquer on Corina bodies uh, checks this way. So look at the checking here, look at the checking there, and look at the checking all over the back and in the neck joint. Uh, it's a two piece body. There's Here's the. Here's where, where the two pieces are joined. It's very neat. Um, the neck is a uh, is a one piece with a little a little stripe here. It's very nice. That's the way that's the way they were built back then. Um, and uh, this one particularly was built with 1978 pots, so it adds a little more you know vintage value to it. This is how it sounds with um, through a uh, clean channel of uh, JCM 2000. Very crisp sound like Corinas have usually. sound and then this is how it sounds through the distortion channel.